Go. Oh, <laughs> sister Lauren and her fiance Stephen. They had a friend's wedding to attend in Tampa Bay so they decided to stay with us but today they are free of their wedding duties and we're going to Bush Gardens. I'm so excited. So all of us are gonna do that together except we don't have hippo. We got the but we called our Disney backpack because we're going to Disney um, but no hippo because we're doing aminal encounter today. <laughs> well we're doing what? Animal encounter. <laughs> Dang it, I did it again. <laughs> that word always messes me up. <laughs> and I'm so excited. And since we are doing an animal encounter, <laughs> uh, we thought it would be best to give Harlan the day off. Plus, she's still like pretty uh, worn out. Um, she had some dogs she played with yesterday, a lot of running, and then, you know, she went to the dog beach. So she's good to take a break. Anyways, um, we have passes to Disney, not to Busch Gardens, even though Busch Gardens is a bit closer. Because, I don't know, we're, we're Disney fans, but um, Busch Gardens, Industries, whatever, they have this really cool program called Waves of Honor. I'll put a link to it in the description. It's basically where veterans and their families can get a complimentary ticket once a year, which is what we're doing now. So, we're going to see animals. <laughs> we made it. Narla's not even with us, but <laughs> with us in hair. With us in hair. Lint roller. Also, I was about to grab a magic band, but <laughs> not today. It's a chilly day for us Floridians. It's in the 50s. It's cloudy. It rained this morning, so it's wet and humid. <laughs> but we are prepared with warm sweaters and jackets, and I've got my favorite hat and gloves. <laughs> Well, we made it, and Lauren and Steven are not too far away. So we don't have Harlow today, but I assume that if we did bring her, when it comes to the ride she can't go on, it'd be similar to Disney system where you can either do a rider swap or they'll have a crate for her to wait in, but I I don't know, I obviously did not bring Harlow. And then they do have an accommodation system similar to Disney where if it's difficult or you're unable to wait in line for various medical reasons, then they give you a return time based on the current wait time. And uh, we're actually gonna go get a return time for a coaster. I actually just made a video recently about whether or not I can ride roller coasters. I'll put it right here if y'all wanna learn more. But I think because of my recent flare up and this weather is not great on my body, um, I don't think I'm gonna do any of the crazy no weather coasters. Is great on your body. Shut yeah. up. But especially cold weather is not great for my pain. Um, so I don't think I'm gonna do any, or if I do, I'll leave it till the very end um, and maybe do one coaster, but I don't know. I'm just happy to be here. I'm really excited for Animal, animal Encounter and uh, the snacks. <laughs> Cheetah Hunt. So it's 30 minute wait time. This is a paper we get our return times on, so they'll tell us to come back in about 30 minutes and then they'll send us through the Fast Pass. So that's the Cheetah Hunt. And it goes underneath us. Can y'all imagine if Harlow was here? <laughs> now, do these live naturally in Florida? Too? Yes. Oh my gosh. They're in our backyard. They're like dinosaurs. They're in your backyard, in your swimming pools, in your bathtub. If it's bigger than a bathtub, there's a gator in it. That's the Florida saying. <laughs> They're here! Not that bad, it's windy. It's cold. We're all here and we're going to our safari. I'm so excited! We have to go here to the safari outpost. Last time I had a map like this, I kept asking Joe, I'm like, where's the you are here sign? And I had to reiterate to her, it was a paper, paper map. map. Paper map. <laughs> had a moment. <laughs> there it is, the outpost. <gasps> we checked in and I'm so excited. We're gonna go see giraffes and we're gonna feed them snacks. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited! It's a standing tour, but I can't stand for 30 minutes. Um, but they have this little window for me, so I can see. I'm so excited. Can y'all tell I'm excited? I'm really excited. 
of ostriches when I was little we went to a petting zoo and my brother I have a brother half brother he's like in his 40s and lives in the UK but anyways when I was little my brother and my dad took me to a petting zoo and the ostriches like pecked my brother to death and chased me <laughs> so I'm terrified of ostriches and emus oh my gosh y'all all the giraffes You love it? That was fun, wasn't it? Amazing. The giraffe's name we were feeding is the Titi. That was incredible. Oh, and I asked, um, service animals aren't permitted on that for obvious reasons for the animal safety and the dog safety, so I think it's good we gave Harlow a break today. Got it, babe? Did. We got a CD of all the photos the photographer took. It's so cool. fun last night so someone had a little bit too much fun <laughs> at the wedding <laughs> but they're chugging along <laughs> all right y'all after the drafts my energy and adrenaline I'm hurting cold weather isn't great for my muscles and joints but I'm gonna hold out because I know my family wants to enjoy the park and do the rides <sighs> might take some pain medicine to help me hold over but Still a good day. That was an incredible experience, and uh, Jed and Steven have already gone on a lot of roller coasters. They're going on Shikra now. A few years ago, before I, you know, quite knew what was going on with me, um, I wasn't diagnosed yet, but having some weird symptoms here and there, I went on Shikra. I 100% blacked out on it, so not a ride I would do again. Too hard on my dysautonomia, but um, here comes Lauren. She got a snack. I think they're gonna do a few more coasters. <sighs> sometimes you push yourself for fun things like giraffes and sometimes you push yourself for family, so. I'm glad we're all together. <gasps> I had giraffe spit on this glove. <laughs> now the popcorn has it. <laughs> Maybe that was a bad idea. <laughs> no more popcorn for you, Jackie. <laughs> we have a solution to the giraffe spit. <laughs> We were throwing them to try and get in my mouth. And then the seagulls came. They ambushed us. Oh my god. Bad idea. Bad idea. <laughs> How 
was Shikra, babe? It was fun. You liked it? Yeah. <laughs> What is that? Chad said it was a duck, but it's huge. It's also very brave. Woo. They're all going on cheetah hunt. After they do this one, I think there's one more ride and then we're probably gonna head out. I told Jeff like, not feeling well and turns out everyone else is actually tired as well, so that works. On a positive note though, my right hip isn't bothering me because I just recently had the Tordal injection there, so that's nice. But uh, my muscles, especially the muscles in my legs, are really seizing up, causing quite a bit of pain. Um, but we've had a good time today. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad we did this. So we're doing the last ride, which is Montu. I'd really like to do this one because it's my favorite type of roller coaster where you're. Like this restraints come up and your legs dangle, it goes upside down and stuff. It looks really fun, but uh, I'm not doing any of these crazy rides today. That would be pushing my body too much. You know, whether you push yourself or not with your health, it's just about finding a balance. And I said earlier that I do push myself for my family sometimes, but they're understanding and I know there's a limit to what I can handle. So uh, after this one, we will be heading out. You liked it? I think with Lauren, threw up a little bit. Oh, Lauren, did you <laughs> I think poop? Lauren, threw up a little bit. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. Love y'all. Thanks Bye. for coming. I'm still here though. You're staying, guys. <laughs> we missed you, Hippo. For the giraffes, say hello. Did you really miss her since you felt giraffe? Yeah, I did miss her. Even though we were feeding giraffe. So amazing. But after a day like today, fluids are definitely needed. Heating pad ready for sleep. So, with that, we'll say goodnight and thanks for joining us on our adventure.